In this video, I'll show you how to connect a keyboard and mouse to your Xbox Series S or Series X. So, for example, you might be switching from your PC to an Xbox console and you can't quite get used to the Xbox controller while playing certain games. This will allow you to use your keyboard and mouse once again. There isn't a specific way of setting them up on your Xbox besides plugging and playing. For example, let's take the USB cable of our keyboard, here it is, and then we take that and we plug it inside of our console. Here is our console, let's plug it in, and as you can see right now, our keyboard just started to light up. Now, let's continue over to the mouse option. Let's take our mouse, here, here is our mouse, and let's connect it to our console as well. And now I have plugged in our mouse inside of the console. Now, for the first thing that I need to mention is that uh, the mouse can't be used inside of the main menu. Only the keyboard can be used inside of the main menu and uh, only a few buttons of the keyboard. Here is the keyboard. And the buttons that can be used uh, from the keyboard in the main menu are the arrows. You can use the arrows to move around. Then the other two buttons that you can use is the escape button which is the back button, and then you have the enter button, which is the enter button. It's pretty self-explanatory, it's the select button. You can also change some of the settings for your mouse inside of the settings uh, application. Let's go and find the settings application. To find the settings applications, you need to go into My Games and Apps, open that up, then scroll once down and go into Apps, scroll to the right and find the settings application right here, open it up, then scroll down until you get into devices and connections. Then scroll to the right and select the mouse option. When we open this up, we can find the two options that can be edited. The pointer speed, for example, I like it really fast, so I'll leave it at 10. Then you can switch the primary and secondary mouse button. This is for left-handed users. So if you're a left-handed user, this will switch the right, left and right click for you. Now let's exit this and continue into the using this uh, the mouse and keyboard in games not every game is uh, compatible with uh, keyboard and mouse on your xbox so before you use them to play that game you should check it out on google whether it's supported after uh, you have found that out you can open up the game let's do roblox i select roblox and i know that roblox is compatible with keyboard and mouse as you can see i have my controller still connected then let's find some of the games. For example, let's do Pet Zero. Let's open this up and let's press join. Currently we, we are joining and soon the cursor of my mouse will show up on the screen. Let's see. And here is the cursor of my mouse currently. Let, let me show you. As you can see, I'm moving it around right now. And now we load it. We can take our keyboard and use it. Let's do that. And as you can see, I just press the W button, I'm running, I press A, I press D, I press S, everything is working as intended. 